Hello and welcome to the Simple Planes tutorial. Today we're going to be building our first plane. So let's go right to sandbox mode. Today we're going to be building a plane that looks sort of like this twin prop plane here. Um, so the first thing we do is we're going to open up the main menu and start a new aircraft. So this gives us just a cockpit and two little blocks and we're going to start building the fuselage from there. So we're going to click on the little plus icon and start bringing over structural blocks. Um, let's throw a nose cone right on front and we can keep adding blocks one by one or we can do something a bit tricky and make a sub-assembly. So let's assemble a couple blocks together and go over and click on this arrow and save this as a sub-assembly. Now let's attach this guy right here. And from here, we can go over to the sub-assemblies and just pull another few sets of blocks out and assemble them together. So now we've got our fuselage. Almost. Let's uh, flip a block upside down and stick it on there just to make it flow right. So grab a long angled block. Let's rotate it. Click on the arrows. And there we go. Let's just shove that right there. So this is going to be our fuselage. The next thing we got to do is we got to add some wings. So let's click right on the wings. Let's throw on our horizontal and vertical stabilizers. And we can resize these by double clicking on them. Or on the right hand side we'll see the wing editor menu. So click right on that. From there we can change the wing shape. We can also change the airfoil if we want it symmetric, flat bottom, or semi-symmetric. We can adjust the dihedral of it. And we can add or subtract fuel from the wing. We can also adjust the control surfaces, change its type. We can invert it, and we can edit the control surface shape. We can also add another control surface to the tip or take it away. Um, next step is we have to add some wings up front, some main wings. So let's add wings. Let's start with structural wings. Those are a bit stronger than the primary wings. So put one of those on, double click it to resize. There we go. And we also need some place to attach our engines. So let's go back to our structural blocks and put a couple of those right on there. There we go. Now let's throw our main wing right to those structural blocks. So double click that to resize. And if you notice, the control surface disappears if we get too small. So once we're done resizing the wing, we have to go back to the wing editor menu and add another control surface. So add control surface. Um, just change the shape, throw it right at the end of the wing. And that looks good right there. So now let's finish up the plane by adding engines and wheels. So let's go over to propulsion, grab some propellers from the top here, and connect those right to the wing there. So from here we're going to mirror it. We can do this two ways. We can click on one part and go over to the arrow and click on the mirror option and that'll mirror just the parts that are connected to that or we can mirror the whole plane at once by going to the main menu and mirror aircraft. So this will delete everything on one side of the blue line and once we hit mirror it'll paste it all back over there. So that's what our plane's basically looking like. Let's show our center of mass, center of lift, and center of thrust. It looks good. Center of mass is right in the, the middle. So now let's throw in some landing gear. We want to attach the landing gear right around the center of mass. So one's in front and one's behind. So let's put one right at the end there. And let's put one right at the beginning. Right there. And throw one on the other side. There we go. And it looks like we have a flying plane. From here let's 
paint this aircraft. So if we look on the right hand side, we'll see a little paintbrush. Click on that and it'll bring up the paint menu. From here we can cycle through the preloaded colors or we can customize our own set of colors. So let's go to custom um, and when we click on color, it'll bring down the, the color menu and we can switch up some of the, change the hue, change the color that we want. We can also change it from gloss, semi-gloss, or flat paint job. If we notice, we have our target set on primary, so we're only coloring the primary parts of the, the blocks that we're clicking on. Some blocks also have trim, so we can click on that and change the color of the trim. And other blocks have a second trim option. So here's the first trim that'll change the control surfaces. And the second trim, the propellers on the engines. I think jet engines and fuel blocks are the only other ones that have a secondary trim. From here we can share our aircraft. So click on share from the main menu, enter in a name, and enter a small little description. Then we can take a little photograph and upload this to the website. And that's basically it. We can fly our planes now. So increase the throttle and we're off.